Hey guys, it's Mark J. Freeman from After Buzz TV's Dish and Days, and I am here at Day of Days at Universal Studios with these three amazing people, Drake Hoesting, Deidre Hall, and Olivia Rose Keegan. Thank you all for coming over and chatting with us. Thank you. Um, 52 years. It's kind of crazy how long. <laughs> it's like, this is just like unprecedented. Um, for Olivia, who hasn't been on like as long. Negative 40 years old. <laughs> I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> how has it been, you know, having these new people that aren't as familiar with the show and how things go for you guys? Like, how is it? it must be frustrating. <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't think that is. <laughs> Um, I'm not sure what the question is, but I, I well, think what I we're think, getting. Go I think ahead. it's about the uh, the infusion of youth on our show that yeah. kind of reminds yeah. us of us 30, yeah. 30, 40 years ago. Right, right. And uh, and the energy and what they bring to the show, and it's uh, the show is it's all about them now. I mean, there is, uh, you know, I think. Um, it, in my case, uh, George Clooney said it best. He said, uh, I, I'm not the guy that gets the girl anymore. I already have her. Oh, yeah. Nor should I be. Yeah. But there's a time and place for everything, and they're going to write a little kiss for us every once in a while. But right now, it's all about the young kids that are coming up and taking the, the next... Uh, we're passing the baton to them. Yeah. And they're doing a well, great it's, job. Well, it's a multi-generational show. Yeah. And it's, it's always been like that. It's mm -hmm. always been... I mean, when we joined... Tom and Alice were there and just held in the highest regard, and we're still the you know the mainstay of the show. And uh, then then they're in the habit of of integrating characters into those families, mm -hmm. and eventually they can sort of you know carry on on their own. But uh, in the meantime, I think the wisdom of introducing them through a family. So mm -hmm. as long as we like them, you'll like them, get right. to know them a little bit, and that that gives them a little bit of a, a, a strong. When, when you came on, was I mean, I, were you familiar with? Deidre and Drake and like was it oh, yeah. intimidating to have oh, these oh, for sure. <laughs> I feel like it would for be <laughs> sure. it still is I mean not really I mean they're so amazing you guys are cool the coolest grandparents <laughs> ever um, but oh yeah for sure I mean they still are at the yeah. top of that you know at yeah. the top of that soap rain um, and it's yeah but you can learn so much just from yeah. watching them yeah, yeah. It's awesome. I ha well, I have to say, I said to you when you walked over, I have to talk to you about something because uh, years and years and years ago, I came to set with. Um, oh my gosh, why am I drawing a blank on her name now? She played Belle, the first oh, Belle. Oh no, uh, Kirsten Storm. Kirsten Storm, yes. thank you. I came to set with Kirsten. She was dating a friend of mine. And she said, um, she took me around the set and we ran into you. And she had said to me, just so you know, we're not going to be able to go everywhere because I'm not allowed to go certain places. And I said, that's fine. I'm just so happy to be here and thank you for bringing me. And we ran into you and you said, Come with me. I can go places. She can. and you <laughs> took me around. You were so. I, I, to this, I tell everybody this story. I was like, how amazing was it? Someone did. He didn't even know me. Just I was friends of a friend. And thank you a million times for taking the time just to take me around and show me the set and take me to the places I wasn't allowed to go. You're more than welcome. <laughs> but you know, there's there's an easy way to go through life, isn't there? Yeah. yeah. So just be inclusive, and you know, it seems to all work out. Yeah. At least it has for me. Yeah. She taught me all that anyway. Oh. So. Well, thank you. <laughs> thank you to you too, then. <laughs> so I thought we'd play a quick little game to mix things up a little bit that we're calling Who Would You Call? Marlena or Hattie? So I'm going to ask a question, and you each tell me who you would call to help with that situation. <laughs> I just think that would be fun. <laughs> so we'll start with you, Drake. Who would you call for a night of partying? <laughs> And she's sitting next to you, just so you know. <laughs> Your lovely granddaughter. Uh, I'd call, I'd call Doc. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Deidre, who would you call for a night of party? Oh, I'd call Hattie. Are you kidding? Yeah, right. <laughs> I hate to party by myself. So. I feel like Eve, right? She would be a party. Yeah. She'd be a, she'd be, she seems it, like but a you only could pick yeah. Marlena or Hattie. Oh, 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 Hattie. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I am. Yeah. But I love how I love how you think about it, Drake. Yeah. Um, who would you call as a plus one for an important political event? What was the question again? Who would you call to be your plus one? An important political oh, event. Well, that would have to be Doc. Oh, yeah. I like this game. Hattie. <laughs> Marlena. I think we're on the same page. 
<laughs> okay, who? Uh, uh, Doc. <laughs> I have a feeling his answer is going to be Doc for a lot of these. Yeah. Um, who would you uh, take on a road trip? Stuck in the car, hours. Yes. Oh, yeah. Doc. At least. Doc. Yeah. Doc. <laughs> John. Which of your personalities would you like to be stuck with, Deidre? I would. Oh, oh <laughs> a, a, a choice of those two. Well, um, uh, I still think Hattie. <laughs> yeah, Hattie. That'd be fun. <laughs> All right. I know you guys got to go. I don't want to keep you too long. Thank you for playing along with us. We love what you guys are doing. It's so much fun. We've now d dubbed you the Silver Fox. Oh. Work that silver hair. We all love it. I love Thank it. Wonderful. It's, it's the okay. first day. Look at, I, my jaw dropped. I was like, oh, my God. Amazing. Thank you for yeah. doing it. We're all lucky to have Olivia here on our show, but, but <laughs> especially we are because she's our granddaughter. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thank you guys so much. Enjoy the rest yeah. of your day. Keep doing what you're doing. We Thank love it. You so much. We love it. We're fans. Yay. Thank Aww. you guys.